coming to the ball. Loses Young. Sticks a three. A little something to say to the bench. Smart stepping up big. Daniel Tice goes one way, sets the screen. No hesitation. It's clutch time. It's Marcus Smart time. And he has something to say, as Mike Gorman said. Yes, I am Marcus Smart, and I make big shots. All right, Hurdle will inbound. 41.7 full shot clock available here. Young, Haywood jumps out on him quickly. Young takes it to the basket. The floater does not go. The tip does. 108-106. Hawks do not need to foul. Tice looking for Haywood back door. Nearly picked off. Smart again gets in the paint. Couple of fakes. Lost the handle. Here comes Young. Tells us don't have a foul to give. Watch out for the three. There it goes. It's blocked by Tice. Oh, oh this. Now the question would be. Did Young raise the leg to trip Smart? Is that what yeah. keyed that whole thing? I don't know, but let's go back to the defense, Mike. Okay. Look at Daniel Tice moving his feet. There's the space. There's a long, outstretched arm. Now, here's where it gets a little crazy. Does he? No, not no, really. No, he doesn't. So uh, It's kind of like two things going on here, Mike. You have the player stepping over the player, which is... Obviously, right, right. A, a deal in the NBA, yeah, right? It's a big deal in the NBA. Whatever reason, they draw a line at that, right? Yeah. Then the other one is you have Trey Young sort of pushing him. Like, you aren't allowed to step over me. So, I think they're just going to call a foul on Trey Young. Not going to be a tech. They're just moving this thing yeah. along. And I think that is the right way to do in this. Celts with nine steals and seven block shots as we look at some Amiki game numbers about to go by. Two-point game. Ten assists for Young, nine for Smart. Celtics playing this game without Kemba Walker down with the flu. 